Mastering Security Policies Leadership owns the burden of securing the organization's future. Who is responsible for ensuring that the procedures for conducting regular security audits and assessments are properly established, executed, and monitored to guarantee the operational excellence of our organization's security posture? The Chief Information Security Officer CISO, is responsible for ensuring that the procedures for conducting regular security audits and assessments are properly established, executed, and monitored to guarantee the operational excellence of the organization's security posture. The CISO will oversee the development and implementation of a comprehensive audit and assessment program that covers all aspects of the organization's security posture, including but not limited to, network security, system security, application security, data security, and physical security. To ensure the program's operational excellence, the CISO will establish clear policies, procedures, and standards for conducting regular security audits and assessments. These policies, procedures, and standards will be aligned with industry-recognized frameworks and best practices, such as the National Institute of Standards and Technology NIST, Cybersecurity Framework, the International Organization for Standardization ISO, 27001, and the Control Objectives for Information and Related Technology COBIT. The CISO will also ensure that the audit and assessment program is properly resourced, with a dedicated team of security professionals who possess the necessary skills, knowledge, and expertise to conduct thorough and effective audits and assessments. This team will be responsible for identifying vulnerabilities, assessing risks, and providing recommendations for remediation and mitigation. To guarantee the operational excellence of the audit and assessment program, the CISO will implement a continuous monitoring and improvement process. This process will involve regular review and update of the program's policies, procedures, and standards to ensure they remain relevant, effective, and aligned with industry best practices. The CISO will also establish a reporting mechanism to ensure that the results of the audits and assessments are communicated to the appropriate stakeholders, including senior management, the board of directors, and other relevant parties. This will enable informed decision-making and ensure that the necessary resources are allocated to address identified vulnerabilities and risks. Furthermore, the CISO will ensure that the audit and assessment program is integrated with the organization's overall risk management framework, allowing for a comprehensive understanding of the organization's risk posture and enabling the identification of opportunities for improvement. Additionally, the CISO will foster a culture of continuous improvement within the organization, encouraging employees to report security incidents and vulnerabilities, and recognizing and rewarding employees who identify and report security issues. In terms of execution, the CISO will establish a schedule for conducting regular security audits and assessments, which will include but not limited to Quarterly Vulnerability Scanning and Penetration Testing Biannual Compliance Audits, e.g., HIPAA, PCI Day SS, etc. Annual Security Posture Assessments Ad Hoc Audits and Assessments as Needed the CISO will also ensure that the organization's security team is properly trained and equipped to conduct audits and assessments, and that the necessary tools and technologies are in place to support the program. In terms of monitoring, the CISO will establish key performance indicators, KPIs, and metrics to measure the effectiveness of the audit and assessment program, such as Number of vulnerabilities identified and remediated Number of security incidents reported and responded to Compliance with regulatory requirements Employee awareness and engagement in security-related activities The CISO will regularly review and analyze these KPIs and metrics to identify areas of improvement and ensure that the audit and assessment program is operating as intended. 
In conclusion, the CISO is responsible for ensuring that the procedures for conducting regular security audits and assessments are properly established, executed, and monitored to guarantee the operational excellence of the organization's security posture. By establishing a comprehensive audit and assessment program, fostering a culture of continuous improvement, and ensuring the program's integration with the organization's overall risk management framework, the CISO will enable the organization to identify and mitigate security risks, maintain compliance with regulatory requirements, and ensure the confidentiality, integrity, and availability of its information assets.